Mom! Dad! Dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey. Let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Dinner time. What the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still gotta do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. You wow. are an angel. Oh, Excuse boy. a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. 
Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had to stop. He could use some goddamn manners. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Oh, I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. You're all sick. Sick in the head. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black Put fuck. your guns down! We're walking you out of here! Don't go near my Mommy, fucking family! I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay! Lee? Lee? I'll kill you! In time. Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. You okay, Clementine? They, they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here! I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. You're, you're worse than the walkers! Dad, please! Settle down! I'll, I'll rip your goddamn head! I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get. Uh, uh, Easy! Uh, Could. Believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. 
Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee. I need you! Please help me! Come on, Dad. Come on. Lee! Is he breathing at all? No. No, I don't think so. Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna what? turn! You're putting all of us at risk, Three, you son of a bitch! Four, You're fucking worthless, Lee. Five. No! Kenny, I'm sorry. what the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! Are you okay? Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. Shh. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad, don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we gotta have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. You talk a big game, but could you do the hard thing if it was Katja or Duck? It's never gonna come to that. Not if I have anything to do with it. For all we know, the St. John's might have- No! They, they need Katya, remember? She's the whole reason they brought us here. And no doubt they're using Duck as a bargaining chip. I hope you're right. I know I'm right. I just gotta get to him. That's all. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. Jenny. He made a bad call. It was premature for sure, but he was trying to keep us safe. Bullshit. He cares about keeping his family safe. He doesn't give a shit about you and he me. He puts his family first, sure. Just like Larry did. Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. I know it was necessary, but I just wish Clem didn't have to witness shit like this. I worry what it's gonna do to her. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh uh. It's not coming off that way. Sorry, Lily. Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. 
But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. Do what you have to do. Oh, boy. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? Don't worry, I'm not taking it. Here we go. Two quarters and a dime. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. Fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. Well, there's our way out, Lee. Clementine can fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. Go quickly. I'm scared. You'll be fine as long as you move fast enough. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. 